Today on USOC Adventures TV, we follow USOC and Pursuit Channel trip winner Jared Thomas from Missouri. Jared is waterfall hunting at Cheyenne Ridge, North Platte Outpost in Nebraska. It's pretty exciting. I start flying, it's a lot of fun. This outfitter is ranked among the country's top waterfowling locations. The North Platte Outpost is in the heart of the Central Flyway. This is an adventure that every sportsman can only dream about. Keep it right here. Hi folks, welcome to USOC Adventures TV. I'm Dan Leonard. For the fourth season in a row, we have once again partnered with the Pursuit Channel to give away free trips going all across the United States. These free trips go to members of the Pursuit Channel and members of US Outdoorsman Central who also win free daily gear giveaways. We wanna take you, our TV show viewers, and members places you have never been and only dreamed about going to. Folks, this show is about the average Joe winning a great trip and being filmed in the process. It's simple to enter and you can do this for free. Go to PursuitChannel.com or MyUSOC.com and enter today. Today's hunt takes Pursuit Channel trip winner Jared Thomas from Missouri. He's headed to North Platte Outpost in Nebraska and a world-class waterfowl hunt. Will Jared's dream hunt be fulfilled? Stay tuned and find out. Pursuit Channel and USOC trip winner Jared Thomas from Missouri is on his dream waterfowl adventure to Cheyenne Ridge, North Platte Outpost in Nebraska. I'd like to thank the Pursuit Channel U.S. Outdoorsman Central also. Jared will be hunting ducks and geese in this amazing central flyway. Jared's jaw nearly dropped when he arrived at this Beretta Trident rated lodge. And what this means is you have to have excellence all the way around. Only 5% of the hunting lodges in the world can receive this award. Built in the 1960s as a purebred cattle sale barn, the Wine Rice's family appreciated the historical significance of the building and saw an opportunity for an excellent hunting lodge. The massive arched beams and original auction block give the space unique charm. The North Platte Outpost prides itself in offering guests some of the country's finest culinary experiences. Gentlemen, welcome back from the field. I trust you had a good duck hunt this morning, had some fun goose hunting uh, this afternoon. As always, we look forward to taking care of you when we get back with a wonderful meal. Aside from the light fare served before hunts, you'll enjoy hot beverages and food in the blind to keep you going, even when the temperature plummets. This lodge is owned and operated by the Wine Rice family here locally in Scotts Bluff and also out of Beach, North Dakota one of the largest cattle ranching families and land holding families in the United States. So beef is king to them, and because of that, we're gonna do the signature dish of our lodge, which is our signature slow roasted primer with beef. It is also known for some of the best hand-picked steaks anywhere. The North Plate Outpost is a highly sought after hunting destination. This is one of the top five waterfowling destinations in the country. The North Platte Outpost offers wing shooting at its finest. Home to extraordinary numbers of ducks and geese, the Central Flyway is the pinnacle of professional guided duck and goose hunting. It's heating up here. Our trip winner, Jared Thomas, is pumped up and excited. Coming up next, he hits the sub-zero temperatures for these mallards. Stay tuned. USOC Adventures TV is brought to you in part by Cutmaster, master knife and tool makers, a manufacturer of these fine brands. 
Oswego County, New York. Visit Oswego County. All four seasons of great outdoors. By Clam. Sets up in 45 seconds. No assembly required. Night Eyes Lights. The ultimate in predator hunting lights. MTR Custom Leather. Quality craftsmanship and American leather come together to create the perfect holster. Game Sled. This product eliminates the strain on your back. Lock that waterproof phone bag. Turn your smartphone into an underwater camera. AMS bow fishing, interlock broadhead, and luminox lighted arrow knocks. These are the essential tools for bow fishing. Our pursuit channel and USOC trip winner, Jared Thomas, is on his dream adventure. He will be hunting waterfowl at Cheyenne Ridge North Platte Outpost, one of the premier fly zones in the country. This is the first morning on our first day of our hunt in Nebraska. The conditions are extreme, with the temperatures at five below zero. It was so cold, everything was iced over because of the dew from the river. Our guide had to repeatedly break the ice so it would make it look like a more natural set. And if it wasn't for the heated blinds, there's no way we could have stayed out there as long as we did. We had to wait till the fog was lifted, but when it did, the birds were flying. I'm finally warmed up. We got two down now. Up here. We were hunting the three miles of private controlled river bottom on both sides of the North Platte, adjacent to 1,500 acres of cropland, creeks, and sloughs to make the North Platte outpost a Nebraska duck and goose hunting paradise. Their season runs from fall through early February. It's pretty exciting. When I start flying, it's a lot of fun. I've never seen so much action. It was a fast and furious pace. Once the fog lifted, it did not take long to limit out. Western Nebraska this morning with Cheyenne Ridge and the North Platte Outpost. Doing a little waterfowl hunting. We started out at minus two. I think now we're up to seven degrees and it's been a complete blast. Had a good guide here. Ross, I want to thank him. Cheyenne Ridge, I want to thank the Pursuit Channel and U.S. Outdoorsman Central. This has been a fun hunt. I'm ready to do it again. Thank you. You're welcome. On our afternoon hunt, we relocated to the main river for some geese. <laughs> the fog lifted very late in the day, so on our goose hunt, most of the geese did not want to fly until the end of the day. Most of them were after the legal shooting hours,
However, we did manage to take a few, including Jared Thompson's first goose. I definitely recommend this place to anybody. It's a lot of fun. If you're an experienced waterfowler or a first timer, this is a good place to come hunting. One full day of hunting in the books. <laughs> now it's time to relax. When we got back to the lodge, appetizers were ready. Each night, they treat you like royalty. They even serve a specialty wine just to go with their dinners. Here at Cheyenne Ridge, they take care of you, that's for sure. <laughs> After a delicious dinner, we played a couple games of pool, had a nightcap, and then called it a night. Day two starts at 5 a.m. Folks, the average outdoorsman like myself can't afford to take outstanding trips like Jared has. You can be in his boot. If you want to win trips like this, you can simply go to myusoc.com or pursuitchannel.com and sign up today. It's free. The Pursuit Channel and U.S. Outdoorsman Central give away over a dozen of free hunting and fishing trips. We want to make you our next movie star. U.S. Outdoorsman Central also gives away free daily gear to its sportsman members. Why not you? We give away gear like I have behind me here on the TV set. Stay tuned, folks. We'll be back with more action from North Platte Post. Our Pursuit Channel and USOC trip winner, Jared Thomas from Missouri, had an unbelievable first day hunting waterfowl at Cheyenne Ridge in Nebraska. It's pretty exciting. When I start flying, it's a lot of fun. He limited it out in the morning for ducks, and Jared even shot his first goose ever in the afternoon. Then he ended his day with a delicious meal that night. This is Jared's second and final day at Cheyenne Ridge Outfitters. The temperature again is frigid on this early morning goose hunt. We're hunting the main river and we can see the ice chunks floating downstream. As the case was on the first day, the birds didn't fly until the sun was high in the sky. But when they did, it was a frenzy. After our extremely cold goose hunt in the morning, we now are going after ducks in the afternoon. So we are on our way into a tributary off the main river. It is through the farmer's cow fields where the ducks are landing to feed. We set up in the blind and the ducks were just in the sky. I've never seen so many ducks. They kept flying from the creek to the food source, back to the creek, back to the food source, non-stop. I have to thank Cheyenne Outfitters here at the North Platte Outpost and Pursuit Channel and USOC. This has just been a phenomenal hunt. It's a great place to go. They treat you like a king here. If you ever want to go on a great waterfowl hunt, I highly recommend this place. There were so many birds, we didn't know which one to shoot at. It was a half hour of total craziness. And that's how you limit out the Cheyenne Ridge. <laughs> I'd like to thank you, Ross, for another great evening of Not duck hunting. Not a problem. Worked out good. I was a little worried after this morning. We, we kind of got off to a little bit of a slow start this morning, but that's kind of how it happens when it's cold like this. You know, five, five below zero, they don't like to move around too much, but right. I figured the afternoon was going to be good, so I'm glad it, glad it worked out for you. Great duck hunting, great lodge, great food. Everything about this place is great. going to be hard to go back home. <laughs> Jared 
ended his waterfowl experience with a signature steak back at the lodge. If you're interested in a world-class waterfowl adventure, log on to CheyenneRidge.com. It just doesn't get any better than this. USOC Adventures TV loves to give away free trips and free gear. Today's bonus gear item is a Grand Old Master original box call by Quaker Boy. This Quaker Boy Grand Old Master Supreme Grade box call is Dick Kirby's original design. Now pay attention. In order to win this box call, send me, Dan at MyUSOC, an email. Use the keywords Quaker Boy. The winner of this Quaker Boy box call will be posted later this week on MyUSOC.com or on USOC Adventures TV on Facebook. USOC Adventures TV is brought to you in part by Niagara County, U.S. World-class fishing and world-class fun. True North Outfitters. You'll find trophy black bear, moose, and deer hunting in New Brunswick, Canada. While there, you'll be eating lobster and prime rib. You'll also be going out on a whale watching trip. Adirondack Outdoors Magazine. Subscribe online today. Orion Coolers. Never lose your cool. Hey folks, I'm here at the Great American Outdoor Show. I'm standing here with Mr. Tom Collins, the owner operator of Collins Low Country Hunt Club. Mr. Collins was very generous, gave us a father and son velvet buck hunt to his ranch. The hunt went absolutely fantastic. Um, Edward Lane and his foster son Ethan uh, they came to Low Collins Hunt Country Club and young Ethan got himself a beautiful eight-point buck in velvet. The young man got a Henry rifle too that, that he hunted with. People probably will want to know how that hunt went for young Ethan. Can you tell us how that? I can. Okay. I can. August 15th is when we open. It's hot, but all our bucks are in velvet for the first two to three weeks of our season. And we can hunt them with rifles, shotguns, bows, whatever we want. There's no broken seasons. And Ethan went out, he sat in that stand with Tony. And let me tell you something, when that eight point buck came out on him in velvet, he was tore up. <laughs> and he settled himself down and made the shot with that Henry rifle. And that young man was one of the most ecstatic hunters we've ever had. I'm telling you, he was tore up. We were so proud of him for making that kill shot. I mean, the deer was dead on the spot. Perfect, perfect shot. And Tom, um, you thoroughly enjoyed doing this show. Absolutely. And you have generously offered another adult youth hunt we to are. come there again this year for a velvet buck hunt. Velvet and hog. Oh. If we see a hog, nope. we're going to do a combo special this time for everybody. You're going to get if, a hog in there, hopefully. Yep, we're going to yep. throw a hog in there and hopefully the father and son can come down and kill a velvet buck each and a hog each. Thank you Tom, again, Tom, for being such a great Thank trip partner. USOC, partner. I'm telling you, y'all did a great job and we had a great hunt with you. Thank you very much. That's part of our program. Yes, sir. Help promote outfitters, guys, And Henry charters. Rifle, too. That was a beautiful rifle they gave that young man for that hunt. Oh, yeah. Did a great yeah. job. Yeah, I understand that when he received that rifle, oh. he actually broke down and cried. Oh, boy, it was, it was really, really good. Yeah. You just said that you have you've been having a great week. Uh, the uh, the hunt with young Ethan and his uh, father Edward Lane um, that show aired Monday night. It did. And we're, we you had said to us when we stopped in to see a Tuesday that you had an absolutely record day of bookings. Tuesday was our best day of the whole week so far. Well, I hope we had something to do yes, with sir, that. Yes, sir, absolutely. You the yeah. people that saw the show, they come in, they tell us about the show. They saw us on TV, and, and they just they love the show. Great. They're looking for a velvet hunt. Come see us. Remember, folks, U.S. Outdoorsman Central and the Pursuit Channel love to give away free hunting and fishing trips. We do this to promote excitement and our efforts to promote hunting and fishing. All of the trip winners are going to be filmed 
and they will air on USOC Adventures TV on the Pursuit Channel. Our trip winner shows has featured whitetail hunts, waterfowl hunts, bass fishing trips, king salmon charters on Lake Ontario, outad ram hunts to Texas, a coon hunt to Indiana, an elk hunt to Colorado, an Alberta bear hunt, and much more. Anyone can win these trips, and it's free to enter. Go to PursuitChannel.com and sign up for free today. We want to make you our next TV star. U.S. Outdoorsman Central gives away free daily gear to our sportsman members. To be able to win the free daily gear, simply go to MyUSOC.com and sign up today. It's very inexpensive to sign up and you get a great membership kit when you join. It gives back all year long. Also, remember, if you want a chance to win the Grand Old Master box call from Quaker Boy, simply email me, dan, at myusoc.com. Use the keywords Quaker Boy. Until next week, please get out there and enjoy the great outdoors. Mm -hmm.